Where have you been, boss? I've been trying to get a hold of you for hours. Yeah, kept you waiting, huh? That was pretty good. But we're in a hurry. We need to film the WCTV announcement. Okay, AJ. Try and remember the basics of doing the morning announcements. We must be really behind D. Colonel. Okay, AJ. Commencing the announcements. Now. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Thank you, you may be seated. Good morning, Willow. I'm Morgan. And I'm Devin, and this is The Morning Show. Mrs. Wentz is hosting Poetry in Paradise at Paradise Bakery on April 28th at 6 o'clock p.m. Those performing are going to be singing, playing instruments, reading or reciting poems. I'm going to be there. I'm sure a lot of talented people are going to be there. Be sure to drop by if you want to see some amazing things. For those performing in Poetry in Paradise, remember to meet in room 227 on the 21st for rehearsals. The City of Surprise is offering a job fair on April, also April 28th from 2 o'clock to 4 o'clock p.m. at the Surprise City Hall. Local businesses are going to be looking for students who need jobs. Let's be honest, we could use the extra cash. You're not going to complain about that. Visit the WCHS Counseling Office for more information. Now on to weather, but first, a quick commercial break. Do you guys have an iPhone charger? Hey, do you guys have an iPhone charger? No. Hey there, I remember when I was that sorry staff, always asking people for chargers, but now I can get an iPhone 5 charger from the Cove. I know, I know, it's great. You should go get yourself one for the Cove for only $5 too. What's up, Wendell County Wildcats? I'm Jay with your weather for the for today. Uh, today will be a a very sunny day with the high of 83 and the low of of 57. And now let's get to the rest of the week. Uh, the rest of the week will be sunny, cloudy, and rainy. Um, Tomorrow will be in the high of 83 and the low of 49. And I think that's all for the weather for today. Now let's just, let's get back to your main anchors. Thanks for that weather update, Jay. The City of Surprise is conducting a public awareness campaign with the theme, Be Yourself, Find Your Crowd, Get Along. I, this isn't even on the script, guys. I think it's an amazing message. Sure is. So there's a survey involving a campaign on, get your phone ready, bit.ly slash syc survey one. It'll be available until the end of April. Be sure to consider taking it. Attention all hosts and members. Today at 2.30 in the lecture hall, there will be voting for your next year's officers. Your vote makes a difference, so be sure to go. And now, on to sports, but first, a quick PSA. Okay, Wildcats, I'm Steele. And I'm Corey. And welcome to our sports update. Last Friday, our baseball team unfortunately lost to the Valley Vista Monsoon 6-12. Good luck next time. Tonight, our tennis team faces the Mountain Ridge Mountain Lions here at 3.30 p.m. Good luck out there. Also in the news, our softball team won against the Valley Vista Monsoons 11-1. Good job, guys. That's all the time we have for today. And now back to your main anchors. Thanks for that sports update, guys. And now for something a little less related to announcements. Fact of the day. Um, on this day in history in 1934, Shirley Temple, yes, that one, not the drink, made her first appearance in a movie. Who knew? It's also the National Day of Silence. So, yeah, uh, we're not going to go quiet, but um, let us know if we missed anything or if you have an announcement that you want to put up. Email us at wchsannouncement15 at gmail.com and tell us all about it. Thanks for watching, and have, have a, a great, great day. day. See you, suckers.